Hello everyone, I wanted to share what I got my family for Christmas and I've already shown what I got my kids for Christmas. We have four kids and I wanted to do a separate video so it wasn't too long for what I'm getting everybody else. So I, in addition to having four kids, I'm also the oldest of four siblings. So um, that's mostly what I've got here next to me are my sibling gifts and what I'm getting for my mom and maybe a few other things, but I think that's it. All right, so like I said, I'm the oldest of four. I am 32. My next youngest sibling is, um, gosh, is he 31 now? 30, 31? And then um, my next youngest sibling is 26, a uh, girl, a woman. And then um, my baby brother is 21. So that's what we've got going on. Let me start with my mom. So I've got, I, I'm probably going to put it in this gift box, basket. I haven't fully decided yet. <clears throat> but I've got her some um, stress relief ashwagandha supplements in rhodiola. Um, so I got these from CVS and I had used my like CVS points uh, to get those, I think, when they were on sale. Um, so I know she's into that as am I so she'll like that. I also uh, have these Trader Joe's wool dryer balls and then another thing going in her gift um, I think I have some hand lotion that I'd put in um, my teens uh, stocking so I'm probably going to give one to her and a lip balm and I might give one to my sister too. Some of this little stuff I haven't decided how I'm going to like divide it up but I'm one of those people that likes to give lots of little things. So I usually put together a little gift bag or gift basket um, of like little things. So one other thing that I forgot to grab, it's upstairs, but it is a flavored coffee. And I got that from, where was I? It must have been Ross or TJ Maxx. And I was in like the checkout aisle and my mom loves anything s'mores and they had a s'mores flavored coffee. And I was like, I got to get it. So that's going to go in here as well. Okay, next we're going to move on to my baby brother, and like I said, he's 21, and we have been loving Dr. Squatch products lately, my husband has, um, and funny enough, my baby brother's like the only one, only guy in the family that has uh, hair. My husband's basically bald, keeps his head shaved. My dad, same thing. My other brother, same thing. His hair's really short, but my youngest, youngest brother um, has really nice, it's not long, but he has nice thick hair. So we, I'm gifting him the um, Cool Citrus Conditioner and the Cypress Coast Shampoo. And I'm not sponsored or anything. I don't even think my channel is big enough to be sponsored, but um, we've been enjoying Dr. Squatch. The other thing that I have a couple of various ones are these pop sockets. And I got these at Target on clearance. I, I'm ADHD, so I have fun with fidgets. But um, this is going to go in my little brother's little baggie. Okay, next I'm going to pull out what I'm getting my sister because she her birthday is the 20th and then obviously we have Christmas. So I have a couple extra things for her. She loves cheetah print, so I found these. My ears are ringing. I hate when that happens. I found these um, like cheetah print biker shorts. They're not athletic, they're cotton. Um, and they were on clearance at Target. So I picked them up for her along with these that I thrifted, these Michael Kors um, cheetah print uh, slippers. And they looked like they were never worn. So these are fun. I'm a little concerned that they're gonna be slightly too small for her. Um, I don't know because her feet grew she's got two kids and her feet grew with the last one a little bit more so either way if she doesn't if they're too small I had to buy them like I had to get them and then if they're too small for her she has started reselling as well so maybe she can resell them and make some money off of them um, which for those of us that like thrifting that's a win-win and then I also have a, a non-pop socket brand, but a um, Nucky's, uh like pop socket type thing. So this was also on clearance last year. And it's, is it Zebra, I guess? Zebra, yeah, Zebra print. So I'll throw that in with her. And then I have two, 
um, nail polish gift sets. One I think was gifted to me that I'm just not gonna use and one, I think this one was gifted. I think this one I got at clearance Target maybe. This is the Essie Gel. So I think I'm gonna give one to my sister and one to my brother's girlfriend. Um, I just haven't decided which one. So one of those will go to the other ones. And let's talk about my brother's girlfriend. Again, just doing kind of like a little gift basket, gift box. I have this other really cute snowman pop socket. So that will be for her. I have a bunch, I am a like sucker for when Target's candles go on clearance, I buy a bunch. So this one is a crystal flora. I think this is from spring, <clears throat> but I buy a bunch when I see them for like 70% off. I'll probably put a hand cream and a lip balm in there for her. Oh, and I also have this, the box got a little torn, so I might take everything out of the box and put it in a gift box. But this EOS um, body cream, the lip balm, and a hand cream. So if I give this, I, I'm, I think I'm most definitely gonna give this to my brother's girlfriend, along with the pop socket and candle. Uh, so then I won't give her another lip balm and hand cream, obviously, but I probably will take this out of the packaging and put it all in a, in a little different either bag or box. Um, this my sister picked out when we were at Walmart and um, she, maybe she forgot about it, but we were together, but I bought it for her. And uh, so I'll put it in her gift and take the tag off, obviously. I do have this, I got this last year, this candy cane shampoo from Native. And I thought that I, I bought it just to use in our house, but like we haven't even, I had other, anytime I see um, stuff like this that's on clearance, I usually get it and we have four kids obviously. So we go through quite a bit of body care and this is just one we just hadn't opened yet. So I might gift this. I might not. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. It may, I may just save it for my kids. Okay. I have one more candle in here. Um, I do have another really nice pair of blue light glasses that I got as a gift when I went to a, um, I work in IT. So I went to an IT conference and I got a ton of like random goodies. So that was a really nice pair of blue light glasses. So I might gift those to somebody or I might keep them. I haven't decided yet because everyone, all my siblings and my mom, we all wear glasses or contacts. So I don't even know if they wear contacts very often, mostly glasses. So it'd be kind of in vain to gift it to them. And there's a couple other stocking stuffers. All right, just a few more things. I showed this in a haul, but I'm gonna wrap these up for my nephew from the thrift store. And then for my eldest brother, I am get, giving him these two um, really nice polos. He loves both him and my husband. My husband just doesn't wear them very often. But my brother, sorry, my lips are dry. My brother works in an office. So um, he really likes when these polos feel like athletic. Um, so like kind of a golf style. And this one is a Walter Hagen. So this is a golf shirt. And I thrifted that. And then I also found this one at Ross. Um, and it's a really nice like fabric. And it is a Hickey Freeman um, also golf polo. So if you have anybody in your life that any guys that like to golf, like golf polos, if you buy them new from like Dick's or whatever sporting goods store, they're like $60. So Anytime I see them at the thrift store or anywhere a little bit cheaper, I try to get them. And they're great to resell as well. So these are going to him. And I think that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. This thankfully didn't end up being too, too long. But I am going to take all this upstairs, set up my wrapping station, and then wrap everything that I have left because this is like the only time I have before I have my kids. So I want to get it all done. So I hope you guys are having a great holiday season. Thank you for watching. I'm working to get to um, 
500 subscribers and so if you enjoy this type of content or listening to me then please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing and then as always guys i love interacting in the comments so if you have any thoughts questions ideas or just want to stop in and say hey uh please feel free to do so and i love saying hi and meeting you guys so thank you and have a great holiday season everybody